Uh, do, do you think that they are, are going to be giving us some answers to these questions? We know that they are now looking at other areas, but we haven't heard at this point about any other active shooter, shootout situation. Well, the amount of information they're dealing with right now is, is quite large. And, and trying to decide what's a priority and what isn't for follow-up is, is extremely difficult. So they're focusing on the highest level threats as quickly as they can to identify and, and follow up on it. They're going to try and give us as much information as they can, but they also don't want to give us erroneous information. Mm -hmm. And how important is it, Colonel Watt, for them to beat uh, dusk? Obviously, it's about 436 in, in San Bernardino. Uh, you know, it is going to be getting dusk. It's going to be getting dark uh, in the next half hour, hour. Uh, that's obviously got to be a very big hurdle for them. It is, and, and they pretty much prefer to work in the hours of, of daylight. Way too many tragedies have been happening just like this one. 14 dead, 17 injured <coughs> at this uh, center that helps uh, disabled people. Way too many of these types of events is is happening constantly now. And I know people are going to be blaming the guns. It's always the guns fault. But you want to know the truth? It's the person that's using the gun. It's not the guns fault that kill people. It's the person that's using the gun. And I just now found this out. I didn't pay much attention to everything today because I was too busy whatever whatever I was doing today. So that's going to be about it.